time, the definition of what an atom is and the description of what it contains have evolved considerably. In 1805, chemist John Dalton thought an atom could not be divided. In 1904, Thomson discovered that an atom could be divided because it contained small particles called electrons. In 1911, Rutherford's experiment showed that an atom has protons grouped within a nucleus. In 1932, Chadwick discovered that there are also particles called neutrons in the nucleus. So an atom can be divided. Atoms contain subatomic particles, protons, electrons, and often neutrons. Since neutrons and protons are found in the nucleus of an atom, they are called nucleons. Protons are particles that form an atom's nucleus. They are represented by the symbol P+, because they are positively charged. Atoms are identified using the number of protons they contain. This number is known as the atomic number Z. The atomic number, or the number of protons in an atom, can be determined using the periodic table. For example, the atomic number of carbon is 6. It has six protons. The atomic number of magnesium is 12. It has 12 protons. Likewise, an atom that has seven protons is represented by atomic number seven. It's always nitrogen. Following the same logic, the atom represented in this example can be identified using the periodic table. This atom has one, two, three, four protons, so it's beryllium. Electrons are negatively charged particles, represented by the symbol E minus. According to the simplified atomic model, electrons are located on electron shells. The electrons on the outermost electron shell are called valence electrons. They make it possible for the atom to form chemical bonds with other atoms. A neutral atom has an equal number of protons and electrons. For example, the boron atom has five protons and five electrons. Earlier, we saw that the nucleus of the atom is made of positively charged particles. Shouldn't like charges repel each other? This question is what led James Chadwick to discover the existence of neutrons. These particles are also part of the atom's nucleus and help to stabilize it. As the name suggests, neutrons are neutral particles. Their symbol is N0. Not all atoms have neutrons. For example, the nucleus of the hydrogen-1 atom only contains one proton. Since the early 20th century, we have known that atoms can be divided and that they contain protons, electrons, and often neutrons.